I'm back. So here we go. Let's get to it. You came? Yeah. I was starting to wonder if we were partners anymore. I just had to dig a little deeper than I thought. Trent, I heard from Lord Hakira. He says that the Proteus Tome and all of the museum artifacts have now come under the personal control of Governor Takagi. Hakira can't help us. What do you mean? That's why we came. You have to understand Kasari customs. Hakira is a lord. His position gives him power, but it also limits him. There's only so much he can do before he violates the station. Anyway, I'm on to something, but you're gonna have to trust me on this one. If we do this, we do it together, understand? Are you in? Check, attack a transport in the nearby Hansu system that is secretly transporting the Protoss Tome. Ah. Ooh, excuse me. The transport is under heavy guard and will be defended. This mission will be very difficult and and uh, potent combat. Blah blah blah. It's going to be a bitch. That's basically what it's saying. Why not? I've come this far, haven't I? Thank you. Ozu, this is Trent, the man I told you about. Ah, Mr. Trent. Junko speaks highly of you. Please, sit. Thanks. Since Junko's departure to liberty, many things have changed here. The old ways are dying out as we become more of a melting pot of cultures. Do you understand? I, I do. The one thing that has not changed is the face of treachery. It is something that we have fought for many generations. Ozu is a lieutenant in the Blood Dragons, a counter-political group that opposes the Shogun. The reason the Blood Dragons have survived is because of our ability to adapt and change, to outmaneuver the stronger opponent. This would not be possible without carefully nurtured relationships, Mr. Trent. Which brings me to you. I am told that you and the Order seek a certain artifact. That's right. The Proteus Tome. It's fallen under the control of Governor Takagi. Yes, Takagi. He has been acting strangely, even for him, since his return from Rhineland. Our sources now say that there is a secret transport being loaded with these artifacts, bound from Takagi, back to the Chancellor. We believe the Proteus Tome is one of those on board. How much time do we have? Little. Particularly since Takagi himself may be on that transport. He's defecting? We believe so with an offering to his new lord and master, the Chancellor. Our vendetta with Takagi is an old one. Unfortunately, we may have only this one last opportunity to repay him for his crimes. Mr. Trent, here is what I propose. You and the Order shall have what you desire if you help rid us of Takagi. Trent, Takagi is a traitor to his people. He deserves to die. Hell you! Do us this service. Agreed. Excellent. We leave at once. <clears throat> One pallet of your finest frickin' hard drink, and I'll <clears throat> I'll do it happily. <clears throat> Anyways, uh, since he came back from Rhineland, basically he got infected. So whatever it is down in Rhineland that's going on, he's now one of them. So he's not who he was. He was odd before, now he's absolutely weird. So uh, he's infected, so he's one of them. So, uh, ew, news. All the news that's fit for you. Uh, this is the call of news. What the fuck? Takagi. That's the one we're looking up. Concern is high for the go the governor's safety as he journeys to meet the chancellor. Nailman. Nailman. Over the issue of the illegal detention of our people. President Jacoby. Yeah, this is the news. This is what we just found out. God damn, there's a lot of news. Someone got a little crazy with it. Someone got overpaid to write the news. Anyways, uh, <laughs> let's go check out the missions. No missions available. Come back when you're on friendlier terms with the faction. Blow me a kiss. So, uh, oh, I probably should save. I'm sure I misspelled that. But anyways, let's do this. Because uh, this mission is a bitch and a half. It's like the second to last mission. Mr. Trent, we will take the trade lane from here to the Honshu Gate. 
Coordinates received. Trent, take point. My sources tell me that Takagi's transport is currently docked at the Yukawa shipyard in Honshu. It is heavily guarded. Apparently they are taking additional cargo on board. Is it the town? That is very possible. Yukawa is a Kishiro base, and Takagi owns a large portion of that organization. through the jump gate, Mr. Trent. Blood Dragon fighters are awaiting us at a nearby jump hole. I'm uploading the coordinates. Why are we taking a jump hole? Takagi is a powerful man, Junko. He has spies everywhere. If we want to have a chance to capture the transport, we need to take them by surprise. Go to... Really? I did not know there was a jump hole over here. I mean, I played this game like two prior times, but I, I've never taken the moment to go, oh look, jump hole. Why didn't we just kick off of here and just take a left? Fucker. Oh well. Hey, hey. We have you in range. Standing by for orders. Enter formation and follow us to the jump hole. Entering formation. Set course for the jump hole. Only three ships? The Blood Dragons are small in numbers, Junko. But they are the best fighter pilots in the colonies. Yeah, this is the second to last mission, I think. It's going to be a rough, rough battle. This is where we find out the there details. Is the jump hole, Mr. Trent. Please go first. So, uh, the infection. We're going to find out about what this infection really is. Um, uh, hopefully I didn't give away too much. Uh, oh, fuck, yeah, this mission. Report. The transport is still docking with Yukawa, Ozu-sensei, but it looked like they were about to leave. I counted multiple heavy weapon platforms and strong fire protection. It won't be easy. We don't have any time to waste. Let's go. What's our plan? We have to hit them quickly and decisively. First, we target the weapon platforms, and then the fighter escorts. How do we get to the transport? We have a strike force positioned on Yukawa that will seize control of the transport. Once we've eliminated the fighters, our people will fly the transport out of there. Understood. The nebula will cover us most of the way, but the final approach will be in open space. We will have to fly as fast as possible before the scanners detect us. Every second will count. I did not realize this was actually right here in the... Uh, on a trade lane. There is the shipyard. Is everybody ready? Dragon 1, ready to engage. Dragon 2, ready. I'm ready, Ozu. Our first targets are the weapon platforms. All ships, engage! Incoming missile. Cancel. Incoming missile. I rest my target. Incoming missile. Incoming one of their fighters is down. Engage the other fighters. Make up your mind. Platform or fighters. I'm completely lost right now. Destroyed. Hold on. I have a report from the strike team. They got the Takagi's men off guard and have them pinned down. Incoming missile. Incoming missile. Shield failed. Shield restored. 
Someone's on me. Yeah, these... Sure you are. If I remember right, I start burning through shields like it's no one's business. Shield restored. <clears throat> and uh, conservation of shield batteries is priority. Is a uh, premium. To all ships, the strike team has successfully taken over the transport. Disengage and protect the transport. Strike team, what is your status? We lost two of our men, Sensei, but it was worth it. The cargo pods are full of gold, diamonds, and thousands of artifacts. Excellent. Proceed into the nebula. Come on, you can do it. Come on, break free. Come on, stop this shit. Go, for fuck's sake. I'm not going to get my ass shot off because of this. Yeah, you guys are just off sucking dick, I know. Dude, stop this shit. God damn it. <clears throat> so, we're being fucked with here. And no one's gonna break formation. Lovely. Come on. Hopefully this doesn't kill the mission. I'm like, what the fuck was that shit all about? I don't see any purple markers saying that I need to do something differently. That was a little rough. Burned through quite a, through a, quite a few heat uh, shield batteries. Heat batteries. Doo -doo -doo. Wonder if the game broke. It might have. I may have to play this one again to see what what happens. Hello. Any Sensor efficiency reduced. Any talkie talkie? Any habla? Tu comprendo English? Four hostiles dead ahead, Sensei. Yes. Junko. Mr. Trent, we have to 
destroy these fighters before we jump. Understood. Come on, Trent. Roof! Roof! Here, boy! Come on, boy! Feel like such a dog. There was a uh, movie coming out. Um, something stupid, Galactic Empire or something. And it's just like I have more in common with a dog than I do humans. She's like, I love dogs. I really love dogs. And then they, they like start making out. I'm like, oh. <clears throat> if men are dogs, wouldn't you rather a wolf? You. Yeah. It's kind of like, uh, hey, lawyers are nothing but uh, slimy lizards. I'm like, hey, if you like lizards, wouldn't you rather have a dragon? To the jump hole. We should be safe now. Oh. Um. Let's form up on that one. I must admit, I got a lot more beaten up before on that mission. So I'm blaming uh, Mech Warrior for all my uh, ability to shoot. So I'm doing a lot better this time around, so I still think the next mission is going to be a bitch, and I have to say the least. I'm going to have to do all my button mashing capability skills, and ugh, we'll see. <coughs> so I think the big thing is I stick on a target. And like everyone else focuses me, so one's the bait, and everyone else shoots me. So I'm thinking that um, I stick on one, I break away, and focus on whoever's focusing me. And what I do is just do all the damage to everyone around me so that I can soften up everyone. Um, <clears throat> and I'm thinking maybe that works. I mean, ideally, if you get rid of, like, one out of five, you now have, you know, 20% less damage being done to you. You kill another one. To the system. Mr. Trent, please go first. If you kill another one, you're down to three, and you just killed 25% of damage that could be done to you. Although, in a team effort, everyone's fighting. So if you can, like, pulverize someone and leave them as scraps for someone else to finish off, that's fine. And that would be like support. Identify yourself, or you will be destroyed. This is Lieutenant Ozu. Stand down, patrol. We have captured Takagi's transport and are escorting it back to Kyoto as ordered. Yes, Sensei. We are almost there. Junko, Mr. Trent, follow me. I have the coordinates. Trent, you take the lead. Where are we going? To Kyoto. Kyoto? Trent, that's the legendary home of the Blood Dragons. I don't know anyone who's ever seen it. Ozu, you honor us. The honor is ours. <laughs> Good luck dodging this shit in a freighter. I want one of those freighters, by the way. I know it's like extremely, you know, it holds like 800,000 units. Even if it holds 80,000 units, that's a shit ton. And I'm like, well, if you get one, you'd have to be not on the usual market because you'd be buying and selling, say, you know, 2,000, 3,000 Here we will time. celebrate our victory over Takagi and Edo. Here you shall receive what you came for. Oh, I, I love the skull later. and crossbones. Check that out. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad I'm docking while the doors are closed. I'll just be bouncing off that shit. So the idea of a station within an asteroid is a good idea. Uh, the problem is uh, the integrity of the walls itself is not something you can actually control or predict. So if you want to pressurize it, you really have to... Amazing. How long have the Blood Dragons been here in this asteroid? Several generations. With Takagi eliminated. The Edo Shogunate is weaker, and our victory is near. Pardon me, Lieutenant. Excuse me. Tell me, how long have you known Ozu? You mean, was he always a radical in the Blood Dragons? 
No. When I knew him, he was to be a promising political student at the Kusari Academy. What happened? People are changed by their world, Trent. Rarely vice versa. Ozu's living proof of that. Yeah. I'm afraid we have been deceived. This was the right shipment, but we have neither the artifacts nor Takagi. He was not on the transport as we were led to believe. Something has changed. So what do we do now? I will make the necessary inquiries. For now, I suggest that you occupy yourselves with whatever diversions we can offer. You? Yeah. Well, I can't just sit here. Maybe the Blood Dragons could use a little help. Joining the ranks of the radical left? I'm not on assignment anymore, Trent. I get to see how the other side lives. You know, it wouldn't hurt you to get out there for a while either. Maybe <laughs> take some missions. From the sound of things, it may be a while. Don't worry. I'll let you know when we hear something. That's a sweet ship. Look at it. Yeah, you damn right I'm buying one. Fucking sexy ship. Oh, we gotta read the news. Anyways, uh... Take a peek at the time, because I, I vowed that I would actually start brewing tonight. Fuck. Of course I'm going to procrastinate. It's eight minutes till I vowed to start brewing. Oh, that's that's one guy with a hell of a sugar chin. Look at it. What do you do? Snorting sugar? God damn. His arms are all thin. His body's not pudgy. I'm sure he's got like this flat chest. And it's all chin. It all goes to chin. He's like got perfect abs and pecs and, you know, buffed out arms and just his fat ass chin. That'd be nasty. He'd be like slug man. Anyways, <clears throat> I'm going to read through the news. I will let you know what I find. Catch you in a moment. <clears throat> hey guys. Um, we're with the Blood Dragons. So basically, we're up in Kashari space, and we were on the good side, and now we're not. So we're on the pirate side of Kashari space. All my allegiance, Blood Dragons, criminals. These are the drug dealers. Um. Oh, okay, why are they friends? Don't know. Lane hackers. Uh, criminals. Uh, Tonia Armed Forces, so I can go back down in there. Uh, okay, so criminal, 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 criminal. Uh, Independent Miners Guild, don't know about them. <clears throat> Bounty Hunters, criminals. Well, they're kind of work with the police. Criminals, criminals. And then everyone else is like business, 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 business 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 so we've offended everyone every goddamn person so the liberty hates us molly obviously no one likes the mollies guyans no one likes them so liberty obviously but now the kashari kasari <clears throat> rylan obviously kasari naval republic shipping that's a liberty thing um I mean, universal shipping, that's a liberty thing. Algeria. So, no matter where I'm going to go, I'm going to run into problems. So, basically, I'm forced to be a criminal. So, I'm like, fuck. What do I do? I've beaten this many times before. I just don't remember what I did. <clears throat> Here at the, the end of the game, things just... Meh. Um, oh, and as for that lovely, lovely ship, I think that was a hauler, and uh, I got the light fighter, so that's what they sell here, and that's what I've got. So, um, 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 I don't know, haul H fuel, see if I don't get my ass shot off. So, um, it's the only thing with uh, real volume here. So... Fly it down to lane hackers. I, I don't see the point. But anyways, I'm going to... Uh, I don't even know what system I know. I mean... Yeah. Where the fuck is this gridlock thing? We're up here. So, if you look at Liberty, it's at the center. You just follow everything around. And there is, like solar system after solar system all the way around and there's just a big circle big big circle and there's a lot here 
So to find it all is a bit of a mess. Ooh, let me make sure I buy enough of this stuff. Because I know I'm going to get my ass shot off. <laughs> I need a... No! Fuckers. There we go. At least there's no buy-sell differences. At least I didn't lose money on that. So, anyways, I may have to get into the cardamom runs. Uh, that's it. I will uh, catch you guys later.